Hey, Antoine. The main thing is when you're splitting wood, you don't want people close to where you're splitting because a piece can fly off. You put a log on a log, a stump on a stump, and then you start like a pie. Sometimes can get away with splitting it right down the middle, but more than usually you have to start at the edge and let the axe do, do the work. So as you release the press of pressure on on the end edge of a round, it'll become easier to split. Go for this corner. Keep my eye on it the entire time. This is the hardest part. <laughs> Getting getting your axe on it. Wow. So this is where, see how it's stuck? I don't have a, my sledgehammer with me. Take a sledgehammer then, it's a couple of wax with a sledgehammer, and it'll split. I'm glad that happened to me. It's, it's royally stuck. <laughs> wow. Get it on the grass so I don't dull the plate. It'll get easier. Dude, this is this is the best fire pit wood, Antoine. And if you're inundated with too much, you put a sign out here. Some of the people will, will want the rounds just man, I need a haircut. Some of the people will want the rounds to sit on. I don't know how many removal jobs I put free wood on Facebook. Took a picture of the rounds and people came and got it but let me know if you're looking for a fire pit when I get a little money to, I've been down and I got an operation this Friday for a hernia and once uh, I start getting some revenue maybe I could donate find a good uh, fire pit maybe an old cast iron one unless you guys got one I can get it and donate it Out. I'm going to give it a little more um. I'm willing to come here and go over it with you too. Ah. And then you say, okay, that does it. Use this as a form of meditation and prayer. Yeah, go shot. There you go. Take a smell, buddy. All right, Antoine. Hey, uh, so on this end, facing the cathedral, there's a bunch of wood under there. I would suggest you start at the St. Louis, the, the arch end of the pile to shovel, scoop out your chips wherever you're taking them onto your path and then you'll see the wood being revealed under there. All right, brother. Beautiful, man. You've, you've, done, you've done so good, so well.
I'm proud of you. And look forward to uh, watching what God does and your family grow in leaps and bounds with all your chickens and rabbits and wonderful food. You've probably been such an encouragement to so many people doing to do this. And God blessed me with his truck for a really incredible price, man. Yes. Bless you. Talk to you when, when we can.